Hey guys, Dylan here. I'm racking a pretty intense audio setup, so I hope you can hear me alright. Today I'm going to be going through rendering your videos using Adobe Media Encoder. It's a standalone program, but it works well with Premiere and After Effects. So what you're going to do first is open up Media Encoder and drag your video into the render queue. All right, and if you have bits at the start of your video and at the end that you want to get rid of, we can do that later. So you're going to pick the format H264. You can choose where you want to save your file in the output file tab. I'm just going to pick the desktop and for the presets, you just click that orange writing up there and it'll open up this window. It's got a lot of funky junk, but all you have to worry about is clicking this little folder up here called import preset. And then you can just load up this file that I'll include in the description of the video. This file just has all the settings that I use and that you'll be using for this video. Well, for your video, this video, the video you're watching, everything. And click save, filter, save FTP settings, and then click OK. But because I already have the preset loaded, I don't need to do that, but you should. All right, so then everything's just set up and you can pick your in and out points over here by dragging these little sliders. I'm going to pick my in point where I go to do the first shot and my out point after my flawless five kill. There we go. Then just click OK. You're all set up basically and um, yeah, if your, if your source footage is 720p, then your video will basically come out looking exactly like the video you're watching now, quality-wise. So you just hit Start Queue. And for this these settings, I've chosen a VBR2 pass. Uh, maximum render quality, that's the checkbox. Maximum render quality checked. And if your computer's not so good, I wouldn't recommend a VBR2 pass, just a one pass will do, and you can untick that maximum render quality checkbox as well. So that just rendered out, rendered out to my desktop, so I can just close Media Encoder, and I'll give you a little preview of the file. So yeah, that's what I call a flawless five flawlessly shooting five dudes and you have five bullets before you have to reload. That concludes this tutorial. Thanks for watching and see you next time.